Hey everyone, welcome back to CS Talk channel. I'm John Bobis and today we have an exciting topic to discuss. Now we have the various types of artificial intelligence. Okay, AI is a rapidly evolving field and understanding the different types is crucial. Whether you're a tech enthusiast, a student or just curious, this video is for you. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you never ever miss an update. Now let's dive right in. Now we have for our first category, we have the narrow AI, also known as weak AI. This type of AI is designed for a specific task or set of tasks. It assesses those particular tasks but lacks the general intelligence seen in humans. Okay, examples include voice assistants like we have Siri, recommendation algorithms on streaming platforms, and even chess playing programs like Deep Blue, etc. We also have a uh, general AI or strong AI, okay? This is the holy grail of AI research. Machines with human-like intelligence, okay? They, they can understand, learn, and apply knowledge across a wide range of tasks. While we have made significant process through general AI, the thing is, general AI is still largely theoretical and lies in the realm of science fiction, like the sentient robot in movies. You know, those robots you see in movies, okay? So, then next up we have machine learning now this is the subset of ai and the driving force behind many ai applications machine learning algorithms allow computers to learn from data and improve their performance on the specific task over time it's the technology behind recommendation systems image recognition and natural language processing so when you see uh, those technologies behind image recognition they are or AI okay so we have deep learning now deep learning is a subfield of machine learning okay now this has gained tremendous attention in recent years it involves neural networks with multiple layers okay mimicking the human brain structure deep learning has powered significant breakthroughs in areas like image and speech recognition as well as autonomous vehicles okay now we have the next one which is reinforcement learning now this is a type of machine where agents learn to make decisions by interacting with the environment think of it as trial and error it's what enables self-driving cars to navigate complex road situations or video game characters to learn and adapt to new challenges okay so we have supervised and versus unsupervised learning now, when it comes to machine learning, there are two main types of flavors. You know, the flavors, the things that makes it keep on going, okay? So we have the supervised and the unsupervised learning. Now, in supervised learning, the model is trained on labeled data, making predictions or classifications. Now, in unsupervised learning, on the other hand, unsupervised learning, on the other hand, deals with unlabeled data, finding patterns or grouping similar data points together. Then we have another one. Now this one is, wow, natural language processing. Now, natural language processing, which is NLP. Now, this AI software focuses on the interaction between computers and human language. Computers and human language. It powers chatbots, language translation, sentiment analysis, and even voice assistant like Google Assistant. Then last but not the least, we have the computer vision. Now let's explore computer vision. Now this is the technology that allows computers to understand and interpret visual information from the world. It's used in facial recognition, autonomous vehicles, and even medical image analysis. Now let's get to the conclusion. We have said a whole lot about AI and all it entails. Okay, now let's wrap up our exploration of the different types of artificial intelligence from narrow AI to the dream of general AI and the various branches of machine learning. Now, AI is a fascinating and ever evolving field, like it keeps on evolving, it doesn't stop, it keeps growing, it keeps improving. Now, the thing is, AI is a continuous. AI is it is a feed that we should actually look for, look into and work in because it's so much, it has so much capabilities, okay? It has so much prospects now. If you find this video informative, please give it a thumbs up and share it with your friends. Also, let us know in the comments which AI type interests you the most. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye.